Hey everybody, it's your girl Yvonne from Woman on a Mission and welcome to my channel. I know you guys are probably looking like, oh my gosh Yvonne, what in the world is going on with you? What in the world is that on your head? Well, it's me shower cap, okay you guys? I was about to jump into the shower and God gave me another message. So I wanted to go ahead and um, make this video and get this message out to you guys. But um, I'm sure a lot of you 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 when you clicked on the title well the reason why you came to this video is because you saw the title and you were like oh my goodness i wonder what this is about right and you're thinking it's gonna be a whole lot of laughing in this video well no this is not about laughing out loud okay but before we get started and get into the message i want you guys to do me a favor and go ahead and like this video subscribe to my channel okay and check the description box down below and click on the link and go to my website and um check out some of the other things that are going on with me at the, with, via the link below and by doing this you know you're getting my your energy you're putting your energy into my videos and you're also helping me um increase my algorithm with youtube so that i can get out there more and more people can have access to me and um, see these awesome videos that I'm making for you guys. So with that being said, thank you, thank you, thank you, um, tribe and, and, and friends. And sit back and get your coffee, get your tea, get your water, get your soda, get whatever you want to get. Um, and get ready to listen to this message. So like I said before, it's not about laughing out loud. This message is about the lessons of life. Gotcha, didn't I? <laughs> okay, there's a little laugh right there. So, you know, God gave me this download about, you know, a lot of times, like I said in a previous video, life is all about lessons and, and the lessons that we go through are for a reason. And the reason why we go through those lessons is so that we can learn and we can grow and we can move to the next level. You guys remember when you were in grade school, junior high, high school, and you know at the beginning of a school you had we we had uh to take tests every what was it maybe once a month or whatever you know at the end of each quarter you had to take a test and um to see where you stood you know before going on to the next uh quarter and then eventually at the end of the school year uh, based on everything that you learned through the previous quarters would determine whether or not you met the equivalency to be able to be passed to the next grade. But that's the same thing with life. That's what these lessons that you're going through are all about. They're tests, okay? God's like, I need to test you to see if you're learning what you're supposed to be learning before I can move you along and reward you with a blessing, okay? So a lot of us are not being blessed and getting what God really has for us because we're not learning the lessons of life. Okay, we keep repeating the same lessons and you all know what happens when you don't learn in grade school, middle school and high school, right? You fail. And what happens? You repeat that grade. Okay, you've seen people or known people who, you know, repeated the same grade two or three years in a row. Okay, and it's not that they, they, they didn't know or they couldn't apply themselves. It's that they chose to be the, the class clown and, and be silly and act stupid and be dumb and thought it was cool to be left behind, right? There's no fun in that, okay? Because you're not accomplishing what you're supposed to accomplish, which is to move to the next level, eventually get out of school, high school, right? Move on to college if you choose to, graduate from college, go to grad school, medical school, whatever you want to call it, and go on out and be in the world and become a productive citizen, okay? And do what you're supposed to do to move along in life. And so that same uh, rule applies with life, okay? It's just like when a baby is born, what happens? The baby gets formula, right? And as the baby gets older, eventually the baby is weaned off of formula because the baby don't need the formula anymore because it's, it's grown. It's got all of the nutrients that it needed to get to help it to grow, to help it to develop more, okay? Well, some of us are adults, Okay, we're living in an adult body, right? But we're still a child. Why is that? Because we're not learning the lessons of life, okay? We just keep repeating, 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 repeating the cycles, okay? 
And then you wonder why you see some people and they're like 40 years old, but they're acting like they're 12 or 14 because they haven't done the work. No, 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 no. We have to continue to strive and learn that lesson so that we can graduate and move on to the next level so that then God will reward us, right? And then we can continue to work in his kingdom, okay? Because our lessons of life, other people are watching us, right? And you just never know who is watching you and who you are influencing, right? And when you settle down and you start having children, your children are going to mimic what they see you do, right? So if they see you continue to be a flunky, what do you think they're going to do? They're going to be like, oh, but mom did it, dad did it, it must be okay. I'm going to do it too. No, okay? You're not being productive. You're not doing what you were called to do, okay? So that's what this message is all about to all those people who are probably wondering, you know, man, why am I stuck here? Why can't I, you know, move along? Why can't I go to the next level because you're not learning the lessons of life and the thing of it is is you know what you're supposed to be doing you know you get the messages from god you know what you're supposed to do okay but instead of you being a leader you're being a follower and following them behind other people because you think it's the cool thing to do but you're only hurting yourself and they're laughing at you okay because they know especially when you're a chosen one Chosen ones are not meant to be followers. Chosen ones are the leaders. We're the ones who are out there helping other people to learn, teaching them so that they can learn, so that they can elevate, right? They're following in behind us. The chosen ones, the positive ones, the ones that are the influencers, the ones that are the motivational speakers, the ones that are the people who encourage others. Chosen ones, right? Okay? But no, that doesn't mean that life is going to be easy. It's not easy for anybody, right? We're all going to be knocked down from time to time. The key is when you're knocked down, don't stay down, right? You get back up. You say, okay, God, what was that supposed to teach me, right? And when you realize what it was supposed to teach you, you say, okay, I got it. Not going to do that again, right? And you keep it moving. And then you come along and someone else, oh, I'm sorry, somebody else comes along. You can say, look, I know where you're coming from. Been there, done that. And then you can tell them how it was that you overcame that lesson so that you could elevate and move on in life. Okay? So thank you guys. I hope this message helped you. You know, I'm still new with doing all this stuff. I know I've done several different videos and it's not easy, you know, um, getting in front of this camera and talking to folks, but it's okay. You know, some of the videos you'll hear me talking and I'll be talking real fast in other videos. I'll be a little bit more mellow, a little bit more slow. But anyway, I, I just love doing this. I just love sharing the downloads that God gives me and the lessons of life that I've learned and anything that can help someone else. I'm all for sharing and, and pouring it out there and hoping that it does do just that. So thank you again for stopping by and, and for watching my video. Again, do me a favor. If, if you received this message or you resonated with this message, by all means, please uh, be sure to click that like button and share this message with others that you think uh, will find use in this message. And until we meet again, remember we succeed by helping each other grow. And I wish you all the best and God bless you. Namaste.